Hey guys, Dan Sperry here from Murphy's Magic talking about Smudged by John Horn. This is a, uh, an effect where you have a playing card selected, it can be signed, uh, with a Sharpie. You then take the Sharpie and smudge the logo into the playing card that they have selected. Um, it's basically a gimmick Sharpie that you just do a paddle move with and you then visibly smudge with your thumb or finger the, uh, the logo of the word Sharpie into six of clubs or seven of diamonds, five of spades, whatever it is. Um, and you're supplied with two of them. So you can repeat it or if you're doing walk around where you may be on table A forcing the king of diamonds, on table B you can have be the queen of spades and you can, you know, flip flop. The only thing is, uh, <laughs> with, with that in mind or those performing situations in mind, Depending on how much of a purist you are, you may worry that a layman on the table might think you've got 800 Sharpies with you because you're technically, you, you, you're, you don't smudge it back. You smudge it once and you show it to them and you take it back. So where are all these Sharpies coming from that you're just able to repeat this? I don't know. That's just a thought that came to mind that I could see some intellectual type layman thinking about. But irregardless, this is a fun effect to just keep in your pocket. Carry it with you, uh, and I even uh, had one of these with me when I was playing with this, and handed it to somebody to have them sign a playing card, and I did not even do smudge. I just wanted to see if they'd think like, oh, what, why does this say six of clubs, and why does it look weird? They didn't even notice. They were just too caught up in, in, in the effect of, oh, sign a card, don't let me see it, oh, whatever, and they, they had no idea. So um, the possibilities of using this uh, are, are really endless. It's a great effect, and I can see John and Alakazam Magic putting out more of these, and not just doing playing cards. There's a ton of other opportunities where you can smudge the Sharpie logo into anything. And with the sort of, uh, I guess, um, onslaught of a lot of Sharpie effects that have kind of come out, Rather recently, the market seems to kind of be getting saturated with like Omni Sharpie or whatever that is. You got Smudged, uh, Bizarro put out a great DVD with a bunch of Sharpie uh, effects on it. There's the, uh, there, there was the Sharpie that it's, uh, it says something about a playing card on it that's, that was put out about five or six years ago. I think that was the beginning of the, the Sharpie uh, you know, invasion. There's um, the Magic Marker effect. That Sans Minds put out with the with the Sharpie. There's, there's too many Sharpies. There's the Sharpie through card. There's there's a ton of Sharpies. But this one's cool because you don't have to worry about anything. It's just a Sharpie. When you run out of ink, you just rip this out. You pop a new one in, or or buy another set of this if you want. I don't know. But you're given to keep it in your pocket. Use it for walk around. This is cool. Um, I would say this is like a a, a, a good you know uh, four stars. I would give this four stars. The routine, there's a cool routine taught uh, on here as well, that's uh, cards changing with the sharp. I'll let you see it, you've probably already seen it in the preview, but the, the, the usefulness of this is not for everybody. This isn't something I would do. Um, I was, you know, messing around with, with the idea of taking the, the ink and, and, and putting it on your thumb, uh, and then, you know, paddle moving back down, and then smudging like I'm, like I'm swiping the ink and smudging it that way off my thumb, uh, just as a, as a thought. But this, um, this is not something that would fit my style, but for a restaurant worker um, or, you know, a little bar mitzvah walk around type thing, if you just need something quick, quick and visual, nothing, you know, too crazy, but just to fulfill a need, this is perfect. And, uh, and I think it would be a lot of fun, you know, a lot of fun to do it, even taking the spectator's finger, you know, if you, with the right crowd control, having their fingers smudge. Uh, you know, the, the logo, lots of opportunity and possibilities, so uh, I, I would recommend picking it up and playing with it, it's worth a look at.